Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video we're diving into an essential piece of equipment used on ships, the oily water separator, or OWS. You may have heard about it in the context of environmental regulations, but do you know how it works? Stay tuned and we'll break it all down for you. So what exactly is an oily water separator? An OWS is a device installed on ships that are over 400 gross tons, as required by Marpol Annex 1, Regulation 14. Its primary job is to treat the oil water mixture that accumulates in various compartments of the ship, like bilge spaces, before it gets discharged into the ocean. You might be wondering, why do we even need something like this? Well, when oil is released into the water it can cause major environmental issues. It disrupts natural processes like photosynthesis and reaeration, damages aquatic life, and can even lead to beach pollution. Not to mention it harms marine life, especially algae and plankton which are vital to fish ecosystems, so the OWS helps prevent all of that. How does an oily water separator work? Now let's talk about how this machine actually works. The principle behind an OWS is pretty simple. It's all about separation by gravity. Oil is less dense than water, so it naturally rises to the surface. Let's break down the process in stages. First, the initial stage core separation. The process begins by filling the separator with clean water. Then, the oil water mixture is pumped into the first stage, the core separation compartment. Here, the oil, being lighter, rises to the top with a little help from heating coils. This is where the oil starts to collect. Next, oil collection and disposal. A sensor detects the oil level in the separator. Once it reaches a certain level, based on parts per million or ppm, the oil is pumped out into a dirty oil tank, keeping things in check. Then, fine separation. The remaining mixture moves into the next compartment, which is designed for fine separation. The water and oil flow slowly between specially designed plates. As they pass through, more oil separates and rises to the surface, eventually moving to the collection space. Following that, the final stage coalescer filters. After the first stage, the oil-free water moves to the second stage. Here, two coalescer filters help remove even the smallest impurities. The first filter catches physical debris, while the second one uses coalescer elements to ensure that only clean water passes through. Finally, clean water disposal. The clean water either gets stored in a holding tank or is released overboard, but only after it passes through a 15 ppm monitor. This monitor checks for any remaining oil, and if it detects more than 15 ppm of oil, alarms will go off and the discharge is automatically stopped. Safety Features To make sure everything runs smoothly, OWS systems are equipped with alarms and automatic shutdown features. These are triggered if the oil content exceeds the preset limit, ensuring that no excess oil is discharged into the environment. Conclusion In summary, an oily water separator is a crucial system for keeping our oceans clean and preventing harmful oil pollution from ships. It works by separating oil from water using gravity and filtration, ensuring that only clean water is released back into the sea. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more informative videos like this. Drop any questions you have in the comments below, and we'll see you in the next one.